Well, it was a wild atmosphere here at Purdue. Coach Matt Painter called it the best atmosphere he's seen here at Mackey Arena in three years as the Boilermakers dominate 83-67 the final. And a big reason why Purdue dominated this game, the big man, A.J. Hammonds. He finished with 11 points and eight blocks. You know, the bottom line is we did not, we were not good enough in the paint. Our best post defender was 6-3. And it wasn't just the, um, certainly what the five men did. We just didn't guard the paint well enough tonight. And our aggressiveness on offense didn't turn into what it should have been, which is a lot simpler basketball. And it wasn't as much the turnovers, it was the drives that um, uh, uh, defies description. Some of the drives we made on, the, on, the, on, uh, on AJ. I was kind of surprised that they, a couple of them challenged him when they were just, you know, one on one with him. Um, you know, you, you got to move him around. You got to move him around. You move him around, you can attack him and get fouls and get him behind plays. But if he's set and he's there, it's better, especially if you don't have the size to go against him just to kick it out. They challenged him a couple times that they shouldn't have challenged him. And if they're going to do that, then you got to try to dunk on him. Well, the Boilermakers wanted that signature win in Big Ten play, and they got it last night, dominating the Indiana Hoosiers. The Indiana Hoosiers will take on Rutgers next. Meanwhile, the Boilermakers will have a matchup with Northwestern. At Mackey Arena, Michael Grady, RTV6 Sports.